Really quick, everybody, this entire video will be timestamped, so if you don't want to watch all and just get straight into a different topic, please check the pinned comment or the little red bar right down below you again. This entire video will be timestamped, and I'd appreciate you guys watching whatever part that you like. And if you're sticking around, guys, hello, everybody, and welcome back to another video. If you are new here, my name is Kyle. I am your guy with many YouTube channels, and welcome back to everything that you missed in Fortnite this week. If you are new here, guys, this is the series on the channel where we do every single Friday and we talk about everything that you may have missed in Fortnite. It's going to be all the news that you may or may not have heard of. It's just everything that comes out, we're going to talk about. The only things that we aren't going to talk about is things, for example, like, oh, you know what? These really cool Chapter 2 skins are in the item shop. There's no point in talking about stuff like that. We're going to talk about like stuff like live events, things in the leaks. With that being said, Let's get into the first one. I won't keep you. Timestamps are there if you would like to use them. Starting off with the first one, and this one should be really quick. There have been some changes to the Island Creator program. So all you have to do now is make sure you have been logged into Fortnite for at least 30 days and in the past 30 days have played Creator Mode. So if you're interested in the Island Creator program, just make sure you're online and you're playing. I would imagine this would not be an issue for you if you <laughs> want to build islands because you'll obviously probably like Fortnite, right? So hey, you know what? There's just a little bit of an update there for you. Next up, it's almost confirmed that we do have an update next week and we are going to see some map changes around the citadel we know this because apparently there is an upcoming challenge around the citadel that has something to do with grind rails and collecting tokens and there is no grind rails there yet so it's highly speculated that the same thing is going to happen with the citadel that we did see at shattered slabs i think it's cool i like the grind rails and honestly with a poi as big as the citadel i think it's a good change for it i like the grind rails always reminds me of playing sonic I'm down to see more. Now, this next one might not age well. Hopefully, it's because I'm recording this two or one day in advance before it's coming out. So, Fortnite did end up tweeting just randomly, Roger Roger, during the Fortnite event. So, a lot of people are thinking this is a hint for the droids to come as a skin. I think I would cop it, to be honest with you. I think the droids in Fortnite would be really, really cool. Give us... I, does the, do the droids have, like, different blasters? I actually don't know, because you could give, make one with, like, absolutely horrible bloom. I think that'd be really funny. Regardless, the droid may be coming to the item shop, so stay tuned for that. Also, here's an interesting one, okay? So, there are Spider-Man skins leaked. There are two new ones coming, apparently, this season. I don't know off the top of my head when the uh, Into the Spider-Verse movie's coming out. It's gotta be soon, though, right? I thought it would be, like, in the Battle Pass for next season, Miles Morales, or something like that, but then again... We've been speculating Miles Morales coming in the Battle Pass for so long. I think he, I would be better as an item shop skin, but apparently two new Spider-Man skins are coming to the item shop this not Excuse me, I almost said this week, this season, which is really, really interesting. I would not have expected to see that, especially since we have another Spider-Man mythic in the works right now. I don't know. I don't know what to think about that, but it's interesting nonetheless. Epic is also officially testing Chapter 4. Season 3, it looks like if Epic Games is testing this, man, we're about a month out from the new season, and if they're testing it, it looks like everything is going to be on schedule, so get excited, guys. It, we're in the hype season, as the Camping Rusher would say. Epic Games is testing Chapter 4, Season 3. I cannot wait to see what they have planned for us. Next piece of news to talk about, we have Fortnite X LEGO. Apparently, there is a mode being worked on and a collaboration being worked on right now for Unreal Engine Fortnite, or at least it's most likely Unreal Engine Fortnite. I kind of think it'd be fun to have a LEGO collab in the Battle Royale. I don't know what they would do. You could give them, like, oh, I just thought of this. Like, what if Fortnite had dying animations like you saw in Halo? I think that'd be so sick. Is anybody ever... People have probably talked about that before. It's just not coming to me right now. But I was thinking, like, maybe you could just have the Lego splatter whenever you die, something like that. Regardless, I wish we could see something in BR. I hope we get a skin. But, of course, apparently, this is in Creative 2.0, this collaboration. Next up, Epic Games updated the trees called Joshua Trees. And those are the trees from Chapter 1, Season 5 in Paradise Palm. So, a lot of people are thinking that this could either be for Creative 2.0 and Unreal Engine Fortnite or... We are getting a tropical desert biome that are coming back and the trees are being updated for chapter four in general. It's been speculated a little bit that we're getting two brand new biomes next season. One jungle, tropical area along with a desert. And you know what? If you want to bring that back, bring back Paradise Palms. I would absolutely love to see it. But then again, I'd like to see new stuff too. I'm going off the rails though. I'm going off the rails. So keep in mind that that's something that could happen. We could get another desert biome coming in next season, which I'm down for. Probably one of my favorite biomes is the desert biome. Something very, very exciting. We have a live event possibly leaked. So there's a playlist called Durian, and it also has files that are hinting towards the Night Night tag. If you don't know what the Night Night tag is, the Night Night tag is in the files where 
it's the downtime screen where it's like the something comes up on the screen after a live event where it says to be continued in season whatever's next in this case it would be to be continued in chapter four season three so that is the night night tag and there's a playlist along with it called durian so people are thinking now that this is actually confirming a live event while it is not confirmed this is hinting that we could possibly be getting a live event i would even say more likely than possibly if you're wondering about it but this is very exciting there are so many things hinting towards a live event right now i'm not getting my hopes up because i'm i, I just want to keep my expectations in check and you should too we're gonna see next week with the update that's scheduled apparently scheduled like it hasn't been 100 percent confirmed yet but a lot of people are saying next week is the update we should find out whether or not we are actually getting a live event but for now this is very very exciting the night night tag I'll hope, like, I don't know what else they could use it for, right? It's the to-be-continued thing, unless it's like, oh, the Star Wars is ending, and then, <laughs> I don't know, I was just thinking off the top of my head, but that's really cool. Stay tuned, because we might get live event news. And guys, I do apologize to put a pause on the video here, but I am recording this the night before, because I have a very, very busy Friday, so I'm going to continue. If there's any other news, I'm going to close out the video, I'm going to look a little bit different. I apologize if this bothers you, but sometimes I just have to do it. My weekends are typically pretty busy so i will see you in just a second and hey again guys it looks like we have a couple more things to talk about and let's start with the car racing ltm and this is actually something that i forgot to talk about this is something that i was supposed to talk about earlier in the video because we knew about this uh, probably like i don't know a few days ago regardless so epic games is working on a car racing game mode or ltm which is it's going to have divisions and there's going to be a competitive aspect that we don't know much about it yet but you know what if this is an ltm that will come out i am so so for it because <laughs> i've been talking about it forever man we need ltms back so if epic games is working on an alternative mode and epic games themselves working on a car racing mode i feel like it could get done pretty well so i'm excited for that actually racing i, I like racing it's just it's like select different people right so not everybody's obviously gonna play it but i will definitely be checking this out when it drops and finally we have the leaked goku black skin for those of you who absolutely love dragon ball the first crossover was magnificent and that's coming from somebody who is not a dragon ball fan never watched it i get chewed up all the time for saying that but still the crossover was great i don't know if we're going to get the kamehamehas back or anything like that but goku black is coming to fortnite as a skin probably very soon because now we officially have it teased in the PlayStation Store, so I don't know if that means it's going to come tonight. Just look out for it. If you're a Dragon Ball fan, it's going to be coming soon. Goku Black x Fortnite. And that is everything that you missed in Fortnite this week, guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you are new here, we do this every single Friday, so subscribe if you would like to see more. For now, though, if you want to watch more from the Clen channel, there will be two fantastic videos on the screen for you right now to check out. Check them out because they're great. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care. Hello, everybody. We were just 15 seconds off from making the video eight minutes. Usually I don't do stuff like this, but so if we're really close, I will. I hope you guys enjoy my outro singing. Watch one of the videos on the end.